As robots become more common in social and industrial environments, enabling them to communicate their intents and emotions will enrich our experiences with them. Currently, the task of creating expressive robots is difficult because programming robots requires both a high-level knowledge of animation principles and low-level engineering knowledge to code the joint angles. To fill this gap, we present Geppetto, a simulation-driven robot motion design system that allows users to create expressive designs based on semantic properties of the desired behavior. We show the utility of our system for designing various behaviors such as happy, sad, or angry robot motions. Based on the user's desired emotion, our system enables guided editing of robot motion parameters. As the user modifies the parameters, the simulation updates the robot's motion. Each slider is accompanied with a parameter emotion curve, which shows the effect of editing that parameter on the emotional expression of the robot behavior. For instance, when designing an angry robot, we see that the expression of anger increases by increasing the robot's speed. We obtain these curves with a crowd-powered, data-driven framework, which is inherently noisy. We highlight the corresponding uncertainty in the guidance provided by the curves with confidence bands around them. We also leverage our data-driven framework to provide relevant behavior alternatives at design time. A gallery of motions displays relevant examples. Users can browse through the gallery for inspiration and load a preferred motion for further editing. The gallery also supports understanding of the parameters by enabling parameter level comparisons between motions. When a user hovers over a motion in the gallery, the relevant parameter values are highlighted on the sliders. A user can compare their current motion's parameters to those of the example and make edits to achieve a particular feature inspired by the example. Apart from guided manual editing, the system also provides support for automatic editing. Instead of manually editing individual parameters, users can drag the automatic update slider to increase or decrease the current design's emotional expressiveness. The automatic slider updates multiple parameters at once. This may or may not align with the user's preferences. For instance, to make this robot appear more scared, the automatic update reduced the walking speed to almost zero. But the user may prefer the robot to walk at a certain speed. To allow users to specify such individual preferences for the motion, we enable locking preferred motion features. To enable the semantic design of robot behaviors, we developed a crowd-powered framework. Starting with a dataset of parameterized robot motions synthesized in simulation, we use crowdsourcing to evaluate the quality of each motion's emotional expression. Our crowdsourcing setup uses pairwise comparisons between motions and a custom processing pipeline to convert these comparisons into a Gaussian emotion quality score estimate. Using regression, we then learn functional mappings between motion parameters and emotion expression scores. These functional mappings power our dynamic slider curves and automatic editing. Our framework and UI can be applied to various kinds of robots. We now show the design of happy and sad motions for a robotic arm using our system. Finally, to verify whether the data-driven functional mapping derived for a robot could be reused for the motion design of a different robot, we conducted some preliminary experiments. 
Here, a happy motion design for the KUKA robot arm was directly transferred to a simpler robot arm consisting of different link lengths and degrees of freedom. We also used a different target position, shown in blue. The swirling and swinging characteristics of the motion that led to the perception of excitement or happiness in the KUKA arm manifested in a similar manner on the simpler robot arm. The parameter emotion relationships of the KUKA arm could also be reused for manually designing expressive motions of the custom arm. To evaluate our system, we conducted a user study which showed that people were able to quickly create emotive robot designs with our system. Here are some example robot designs created by our participants.